Hi, this is Ram Gopal Verma and congratulations to iDream for reaching 1 million subscribers. But generally, if you look at it, especially if you have film making, editing, style, and style, so if you have a lot of people, you can do it all the time. You can do it all the time, when you are at least when you are sitting alone and thinking. Yes, I have. I have cried. Not just pinch of pain. I have cried. I wrote a poetry one day. I just cried. Uh, one of the films that had come out, um, Indian films, and it was getting a lot of credit and everyone was going gaga over it and I said, might be if I wouldn't have gotten married, might be if I wouldn't have had children at a young age, might be I would have also been a very known filmmaker and people would have been also praising me uh, mm. for, might be I would have been in that position today. One evening, I think in so many years, that one evening I cried my heart out. I said. <laughs> But then I look at my kids and I look at my life and then say na in Hindi the same kabi kisi ko zami to kabi asma nahi milta. Either you get this or you don't get that. Today God gave me to. This is all hypothetical now, but I thought it was the need, definitely it was. I was doing this interview for 3-4 days. I was doing my research for 3-4 days. I didn't know the truth about it. I didn't know the truth about it. That's why I felt that there is a need to talk about it. Yes, so as a woman, I'm telling you, so for Women's Day, this whole, again coming back to this interview, uh, we are unsung heroes. We have always been un unsung heroes. Mm. Uh, Indian women, Annagani, even foreign. I can't see. I'm only talking about India and Indian women right now because I'm born here. Mm. This is a society I'm living in. I don't want to talk about foreigners. I don't want to talk about foreign way of living because yeah. I've never been a part of it. So I will, uh, I will, I don't want to generalize. I'll specifically talk about Indian women today. So what happens with us is, as you said in your introduction, we are born as someone's daughter or someone's wife, someone. So we always someone's someone. माने कि सोनता identity चालत चालत तक्कु अस्तुंदे. So coming to like the Women's Day, so we I feel कि today this interview, if we can talk about or discuss or have a conversation about how women can get there without losing the essence of a woman. So you don't have to be a man. Like I went wrong in that. Yeah. I tried to be a man in my teenage, just to or my all my 10, 12, 11, 12, just to prove a point to my parents. You know, I can also be like a boy. Why are you loving me less? Meeru na ko endu ko enta dueshis tunnaru because I'm a girl. So I don't want that to happen to women. I don't want that to happen to girl children. I don't. But atarva ta meeru women lagne che sir. Ande teenage lo che sun dochu. But once you enter the industry. You as a woman, you have capabilities, you have credentials, you have merits, you have to show it as a woman. As a woman only you showcased. So I dealt with it when I became 16, 17. I stopped that whole tomboy thing. I said my parents have to love me for being a girl. I don't want to be loved for being a boy. I don't want to act for being a boy. So then I changed. I said, I am not here. I am not here. I am not here. I am not here. Again, my outlook towards life changed. I have a question about personal experience. One woman, especially you, you have to do a lot of work, 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 you have to do a lot of work. What do you think about the woman at the end of the day? Yes, 100%. Where you... Women are always at the receiving end. Majority of the women. There are very few women in this world who are lucky, but majority of the women are always on the receiving end because uh, we are always taught or nurtured as kids to understand, to accept, to adjust. We are the ones who are supposed to do the adjusting always. So, 
hundred percent. Receiving it is like a doubtless answer. I can give you thoughtless answer. It is yes. Mm. It is it is a fact, uh, Prema. And at least nowadays we have started accepting the fact. To give this interview four five years ago, ten years ago, I would have felt little weird. How do I talk about feminism? How do I talk about women? What will people think? Now, as I said, the times are changing. Society is changing. So at least we can talk about it. At least we are creating awareness about it. Mm. So that uh, only receiving and lo unna ru. But kunchum kunchum we puru times are changing. Mm. And we are getting better. Mm.